sub to Patreon, you get 43 digits of pie instantly transferred to your brain. True. Absolutely true. High concentration of subjects. Wait, you don't know? The 499,598 digit? You actually don't know? What a loser. <clears throat> I would tell you, but I don't want to spoil the surprise. Welcome to Summoner's Rift. I don't want to spoil the surprise that's found on the 201st page of the book. <laughs> Chat, we're playing mid lane, by the way. We got another sick White Lotus. Life betrayed me. <sighs> A bunch of same characters. We're playing mid lane. I hope you guys are ready. We're gonna have a lot of impact in this game. A lot of impact. Infinite impact. Minions have spawned. Oh, the void. I miss the darkness. Chat, which build are we gonna run? You got you got You got any ideas? I know which one we're going, but I wanna know if you know. Always mid, never support. Most definitely not true, but that's why they call you Trauma Ben. You don't know shit. I didn't read chat while looking at the monitor. I uh, memorize. Glance quickly, kind of deduce what you wanted to say by looking at a couple of words. And uh, I do it in between minions. You know? You're a wizard, Harry, of course. I play this game a lot. You know? Sag, indeed, my friend. <clears throat> Burn? No, 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 no. I think we're gonna go full pen here for the nukes. We're gonna go nukes. We're gonna have that Ronaldo kick, you know? If you guys remember, the old Ronaldo. We're gonna have that insane, powerful kick. Yeah, Arclight is so smooth, man. Oh. Sorry, Flash. <laughs> no, that didn't work out too well for them. Good job. <clears throat> I will not recall the disc gold, honestly. Such fascinating evolution. No recalling without money. Okay, what a heal for a shield. Okay, I'm not bot lane. My bot lane does well. That's honestly incredible. I'm genuinely surprised. Penaldo. That's unexpected. Have you guys heard of Penaldo? Digging deep, guys. 
How's everyone's weekend going? Yo, Golden Kush, what's up? It's going solid. Pretty, pretty solid so far. Okay, already no teleport. I have to be slightly pushing. damage broken. I might have wounded it. Got sick yesterday? Yeah. I got I got sick as well. I got a very sick migraine. It nearly executed me. Are in old, move to mid covering. Damn. Genders are more easily discerned by the picture of the eyes. Well, very nice guys. Never again can lose in lane, boys. Lesson number one. Lesson number one. Bro thinks he's pink ward. <laughs> oh, that's very funny. Shit. That's genuinely funny. Bro thinks he's pink ward. Oh! Good game. Can you transform and knock him away? That Jace is a bit. is a bit weird. Zach nearly won the game here. Ah. Creatures ah, yes. During the gaming be happening. An ally has been slain. Zach winning it all. Mostly boring matchup, but whatever. Oh, no counterplay. No counter he came from the Rex Eye side. Not much could have done there. Hopefully Israel gets the skill, should be pretty good, nice. Man, Wukong is a lousy imitation of Phantom Lancer in Dota. That's a Giga Chat character right there. Nana six smurfing. He he was playing in a Russian LCS thing. Yeah, 
Yeah, yeah, Wukong, I know. I know Wukong. You don't have to tell me Wukong. I know you're Wukong. You don't have to tell me Wukong. I know. I only been lose been lose today. It's terrible. I'm two and four, so I have it worse, maybe. I think this is winning. There's no way in hell she has ult and she doesn't have flash. Uh, I guess she does have flash. My bad, my friends. Bro, what is happening with Timon in the top lane? Somebody stop Timon! Can we not intimate? That would be marbles. Such or a fascinating top evolution. Guys, don't you poke fish Timon? We don't poke fish Timon when he's playing for the enemy team, okay? It's a reset. A motherfucker. Video game. Video game. Video game. Video game. Why? Why video game? Why would you do that? I dodged the charm clearly. I predicted where she's gonna shoot. She missed it, and it charmed me. And if I live there, I get a kill. Everything is better. I get my item. I got the dragon at least, but man, we're getting top diff. You miss XCOM night? One day they shall return. God, now I have to buy scuff build. At least we are bouncing waves kind of properly while they're sinning. Tim on no flash. I gotta love the R, you reset mechanic. You gotta love the R, you reset mechanic. Kills your teammates, gets a free dash. Monopoly tonight, only if it's hyper competitive. And all of you put like 50 all subs the on the line. Of blood and flesh. I refuse to play casual Monopoly. My talents in Monopoly are squandered with your lousy gameplay, guys. Because I have 100% win rate on Monopoly. Not wasting the win rate anymore on uh, non high stakes games. Damn, we actually trying to lose. Wow, they didn't hit. Advice plus one to Diamond 4, you look jung jungler to get a plus plus one. Have a nice stream, brother. Good luck. Um, that's about the elo where um, people mostly have similar skill in terms of like micro mechanics. When you gank something, you know it's gonna be like winnable. Or like it's gonna pan out mostly the same way, because most people will play the same way at that, at that elo. So my suggestion is to focus on the externalities things that can shape the game in like a in terms of macro like where do you want to play and why 
You know why I did this ult? See, this ult is like a high elo ult right here that I did. You know why I did it? Because I know enemy Wukong is bot. And even if I don't kill, I get pressure on the map. We got 2v1 here. You're ganking top without flash. We killed him 2v1. I'm 1v2 on the weak side. So if I don't ult them there, they will double ult me and I will die. So the play was to just force their hand. And now they're docile. And I get to farm on the weak side for free. So that's a bit of like a... It was correct micro-mechanically to play it like that, but it was a good decision-making on the higher, higher end of things, right? So that's what you gotta think about, like the global thing about the game. That's what most people don't think about. You guys really chasing him and started doing damage to turret. Creatures moving and increases if I had Ludens, I would have killed it, I'm pretty sure. <clears throat> High concentration of subjects. We're getting ganked by Timon and Pumba. I'm getting a quick reset, okay guys? I have a lot of money. Should be our dragon for free, I think. No, maybe not. Like, what the fuck? Your team has destroyed a turret. Um, what the hell are we doing? I will come over for this, man. Okay, okay, good. Kane Abuser, what is up? What is up, numbered Kane Abuser? Appreciate the first time sub. That was so fucking loud for some reason. I have no idea why. Thank you, my friend. Thank you for tier one. Really means a lot. I mean, a little details about macro gameplay? Yeah, exactly. You need folks about, about like, why you're ganking said lane. Like, you need to package that into a certain narrative. Like, why are you doing something? Instead of just doing it for the sake of, I'm gonna get fit, you know? Like, you are gonna get fit. Your, your goal is to get fit. The question is, like, what what is the best way to invest your time? Because sometimes, like, the best thing is to do nothing because it would benefit you, like, on the macro scale. And the only thing you can do is like fuck up your game by going too aggro or like making some misplays. Like you really need to have like a narrative about the game while you're doing something. That's the most important thing at higher level. See here, my job is not to kill her because we're down in pressure. And I could have easily comboed there, but I don't want to because I'm 1vx mid lane. I'm 1vx which is infinite enemy players mid lane. You see nobody on the map and we are resetting post dragon. So I could have ulted there, been greedy, and I would have died to like Zack jumping in, like Wukong going in, knocking me up, you know? So I just avoid that. And I, I don't even attempt to play there, because what does that play achieve? If I die, we lose mid turret. If I get a kill, we get absolutely nothing, because our pressure is being reset on the map. Right? See, this TP, I don't know if it can work. I can go here. I can't go there, because I just need to die. I can maybe trade a kill from this side. See if we can trade a kill. There we go. That's pretty good. We got Wukong Flash and we traded his ass. Ari's very low. She's super low. She got shielded, speed it, sped up. We I mean, know where she is because of the, the glitter thing. Okay. Cool. 
Your team has destroyed a turret. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate the support. Your turret has been destroyed. <clears throat> they have no MR, so I'm rushing this instead of the Archangel. I'm rushing Pen, because I want to have the, those nukes. Uh, I want to do true damage. Once I finish Shadow Flame, we're going to go for Archangel, top up our AP, and uh, it's going to give me a, a layer of safety versus like these burst characters. So I can burst, survive, and leave, you know. How to defeat my greedy mid mentality? Well, just as I said, you got to justify your place. If you're getting a kill for the sake of getting a kill, instead of getting anything else like on the map, it's like kind of lousy, you know. You only take those if they're super free. I have to give up a cannon for that, man. We play mostly a poke in and out here. We don't really have hard engage, well they do. They have double hard engage. So a dragon is the perfect wing cone for us, because we can bait them to come into us while we're poking them and controlling the river. See how we opted in for like a optimal wing cones for our cone. Because if we just play to fight, like we're gonna lose this game. See that's a big nuke right there. I really hurt at this stage. I hate that bug. When you see a ward but you still can't ping it. I saved him. I realized I was dead, so I tried to save him. Yeah, my team gets absolutely wiped there. We didn't focus Zach fast enough to burst him. So that's terrible. Now we're in a very, very difficult spot. We need to rush tempo on the dragon here. Rex, I was mispositioned. No, we just didn't like. It was a bad rush, like, cause it. We are waiting on the 4th Dragon, we don't need to flip it on this Baron. It was absolutely unnecessary given the fact that I had the crab and we had zero vision control. Right? If you want to do this, you have to completely cut off the vision, zone them out, poke them, then do it. My team was like, rush, and they just rushed. So, it was a lousy call, and we got punished for it, which is good, because it's good feedback. It's very good feedback, like instantaneous feedback, like, oh, shit. Shit call, instantly punished, good. So now we learn, like, not to do that. That was just a completely unnecessary play to go for, because we were winning dragons, so we're gonna win the next one anyway. So now this dragon gets very dicey. Like they have probably like 70 chance to win, get it, and we got like 30. I'm trying to land some miracle cues and squishies, but that's a good thing about this nuker build is if I can find it, it's gonna be heavily worth it. Good poke by Israel. They're positioning his ass. Drag going in, drag going in. Good interrupt. Okay, 50 50. We get it, and now we fight. We're stronger. Because they took a lot of poke before the fight. So we should be good. Ari can burst me. Brooks. I get the nuke. Good. Enemy double kill. Good. Double kill. Decent fight. Aced. Five for two. Keep my flash up. And we got the dragon soul, which is now huge for our build. The light here is harsh. I'm a lot stronger than this army. 
creature's mewling increases during dissection. Zeri is almost there to the point where she pops off. But as long as we can burst Zek, like we're good. Their comb falls apart if you kill their front line. Catch the babe siege, we should be able to get tier two. Okay, this is a tight spot, so the second gauge can be devastating here. We really gotta lay down our poke. Or I can bait it with a flash and then we can try to try to fight him, you know? We gotta kill the ward. Yep. A ward like that cannot exist if you wanna have a productive siege. We're all taking the same pathing, which is not good. I need to lay down. See my positioning here? See my positioning here? I I just didn't allow that because I know once they're only Vin Vincon. They have one Vincon and that's like stacking us all up. And I'm just like using my teammates as baits. And that's about it. Beta Diari, the Tremor Vision from Rick's side, very useful. And now we break the game. And that's wonderful game control. Wonderful game team fight control. We did exactly what our team needed us to do, and uh, here we go. You will play. That's a pretty decent educational game, I guess. We got only 19 LP. You, you play, 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 play.